Okay, so I want to demonstrate uh, the new early access of Zen Studio 9. Uh, so the first noticeable uh, thing to uh, that you can see here is a new way to customize your Zen Studio. Basically, you can use this um, uh, you know nice welcome page to select what features you want to install into your Zen Studio. So you don't have to get all things uh, into the uh, ZAM Studio, uh, but select specific like uh, I want Git and GitHub support, MyLane and uh, SVN support. And then I click on Apply Changes and everything works, Every, the installation just uh, updates my ZAM Studio with all the plugins necessary for these features. So uh, this is the first thing that uh, really makes the whole experience with installing and customizing your Zen Studio. Uh, the second thing that I want to show here is how easy uh, to uh, start with a new project. Uh, for example, with GitHub, uh, I have a GitHub account with everything installed. Uh, uh, you know, after I install the GitHub support, uh, I click on the new project uh, from GitHub. Uh, oh say uh, the project name, my password and username and uh, after I click on refresh I can see all my repositories uh, on GitHub so I'll select a simple project um, and hit next. Uh, here I specify where I want to host my application so basically I'm going to uh, select one uh, uh, you know, container that I have on the cloud. I'll click finish, and uh, the cloning operation starts. Uh, you know, it just clone my project from GitHub, creates a, a repository, a local repository uh, in my workspace, uh, so I can start working with uh, with Zen Studio and the GitHub project, and then just deploy it on, uh, on my uh, cloud container. So let's uh, wait for a moment to the project to be completely cloned. Okay, it adds all the things rel related to the, the project. If I'm missing some configuration, it just uh, does all the things under the hood and what I can see is that my project is uh, ready for uh, for testing so I can actually uh, launch the PHP application and let's call it example my example I specify where exactly I want to run this application I click on finish and uh, the project is deployed into an app as an application uh, on my uh, remote uh, container um, and basically what I can do uh, from now on is to see my application running and any change that happens on my um, on my uh, local environment is going to be reflected so for example I'm going to change the uh, this text to uh, a more meaningful one I go and uh, fix it so I'm changing uh, locally, hit Control s the file is uploaded and once I refresh the page uh, everything is updated on my uh, remote container. So this is just one example of how uh, it is easy to create um, an application very fast uh, with um, Studio and the new uh, cloud features. Thanks for watching.